Everyone, welcome Nicole to the Mari Show. Now, when this photo was taken, Nicole was actually eight months pregnant. And here's the twist. At the time, she didn't even know she was pregnant. She literally found out four weeks before she gave birth to her son, Alan. So because, because of this confusion, Nicole's ex-boyfriend, Wyatt, instantly began denying that he was the father. <laughs> and, and backing up Wyatt in his denial is his ex-girlfriend slash new best friend, Carissa. Watch this. Nicole is nothing but a manipulative piece of trash. That's right, a money-hungry bitch. I know I'm not Alex's father. She didn't even tell me about the baby until she was eight months pregnant. Who does that? Not to mention, she told me that three different men could be Alex's father. Total whole move, if you ask me. Nicole, when this test proves that I am not this child's father, you need to leave me the hell alone. And go pin your baby on guy number four. Wow. How does it make you feel that, I mean, his former girlfriend and now just friend, Carissa, has involved herself in all of this. She needs to just go back home. She has nothing to do with this. She may be the ex-girlfriend. She just needs to take her out. Back home. OK, so, so let's talk about this uh, romance you had with uh, Wyatt. He kind of broke up after a month, right? We had such a good time. We posted on Facebook finally after a couple of days that we were in, finally in a relationship. Right. After a month, the day before Thanksgiving, we were supposed to go to his family's house for Thanksgiving. He broke up with me for no reason. No, 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 no because you're falsely accusing me So then me the shock of your life you're is a liar. you did make a mistake when you told Wyatt about your pregnancy. What did you, what, what mistake? Uh, that there could be another possibility of a dad, Jeez. but I'm a hundred percent. I mean, beyond a hundred percent that Wyatt is my my kid's dad. Okay. How many times has Wyatt seen him? He's only seen him once. Once. Just that one time. <laughs> I mean, uh, once he's seen, once he's held on to my baby. child. She's shut not up. my son. You are just so rude. Carissa says you told her that over three different guys could be the father of. There is no oh, way that's so close. close. And I this wouldn't happen. Thing. Guys, whenever I just slept with two guys, but one was right before I got with Wyatt, and then there was Wyatt. We're gonna meet Carissa a little later, but first, your ex, Wyatt. Wyatt, come on out. <laughs> Wyatt. How would you describe this young lady? Manipulative. She constantly lies all the time. She's white trash. Oh. It, I am not white trash. Wyatt, you've been down this road before. Yes, sir, I have. And you've raised a child. I've raised a child for a year and a half of my life. And come to a need any test, he wasn't mine. Right. And I'm not about to let myself go down that again. Yeah, and you still want to be able to claim, you know, say, you oh, think that's that Alex looks yeah, like you? Okay, no, I don't. Because the way I see it, look at her eye color. Look at this. Look at the shape of our face. So let me ask you this. She says you all had a hot, heavy, one month whirlwind romance. No. And then the day before Thanksgiving. Whatever. You came and stayed the night twice at my house and me at every single time. At your house. Okay, yeah. At the same time, you and I were sleeping together. You were sleeping with I another wasn't man. Sleeping with anybody else. I stayed in his daughter's room whenever we were dating. Okay. okay. So why? Take me back to the day she told you she was pregnant. What happened there? It was a phone call. She said, hey, by the way, I'm eight months pregnant with possibly your kid. Really? What'd you think? I was, I was like, no, there's no way. How do you not know you're pregnant for eight months? Is your friend Carissa in your head? I mean, what is she telling you? She's not in my head any at all. She's more of like a person who supports me. And not only that, she's known more about what's going on about the current situation at her house. Well, we're going to take a pause. Nicole. Do you want to tell Wyatt something he doesn't know about? Alex has autistic. He's autistic. We found out a year and a half into him you know, being here. They don't know how severe he is, but he has a speech delay. But he's doing better. Yes, he's actually talking now, where he's actually saying, <laughs> he's saying, he's saying, Dad, because I am, I've been showing him your picture. 
the picture well, that I, from him holding him since a baby. I've been saying, like, this is your dad. Okay. Time to meet Carissa. Carissa, come on out. Oh, wow. Shut the up. Wow, Carissa. Why are you so emotional? Because she's a liar. You just need to take your own back to Oklahoma. Go back to Oklahoma and take care of your own damn kids. tell you that there could be other possibilities? Yeah. Every time I went to go pick up my son, she would literally say, well, I just found out that da 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 does not the dad. I'm going after Wyatt next for child support. Oh. I told you that there was one other possibility. Who said that? And they're that? going for child. I Who told you that? I was going. You're only after the money. I'm not after the you money. You are because I you have a, a good nurse. job. I am a nurse. You're not a nurse. I make plenty of money. You are not. I'm not I don't be want his help. I don't need his huh? help. So I can I'm take care of this all by myself. You can do it all by your mighty self, right? I can't take do it by myself. I've been doing this for the last three years stop. on my own. Stop. Here we go. In the case of three-year-old Alex Wyatt, you are the father. <laughs> Thanks for watching this dramatic DNA reveal. If you want to see more paternity stories, click here. And be sure to subscribe to be the first to know about all new DNA drama.